Hi, today I have 5 true false statements for you and I encourage you to stop video here, read all the statements, make your correct choice and then you can run video again and compare your answer with my answers and explanations. And here is the first statement, both individuals and populations can evolve and this is false statement because only populations can evolve and individuals only can adapt. And second statement is uh, real world populations are usually found to be in the state of genetic equilibrium. And this is also false statement because uh, in real life populations are usually uh, under influences of different factors such as non-random mating and um, also there can be genetic drift due to uh, migration and also uh, there can be mutations, so all these factors uh, eliminate uh, uh, genetic uh, equilibrium, so the answer would be false. And next statement is, if population is in genetic equilibrium, then p squared plus 2pq plus q squared equals to 1, and this is a true statement, we call this uh, formula, um, Hardy-Weinberg equilibrium, where uh, P squared stands for the homozygous dominant, capital A, capital A. 2PQ stands for the heterozygous frequency in the gene pool. And uh, Q squared stands for the homozygous recessive, small a, small a. The next statement is, if gene capital A has a frequency of 0 0.7 and uh, gene small a has a frequency of 0 0.3, then the frequency of the heterozygote would be 0 0.21. And this is false statement, because as you see, according to this uh, formula, Hardy-Weinberg formula, the frequency of the heterozygote would be 2 multiplied by p, and according to this uh, statement, this is uh, 0 0.7, so 0 0.7 multiplied by frequency of the small a, that is 0 0.3, so the answer here would be 0 0.42, so this is false statement. And the last statement, uh, mutation occurs to fill the need, and this is also false statement, because uh, mutations occur uh, just randomly in population, and if those mutations are beneficial, they would stay in the gene pool and uh, would make new allele, and uh, allele frequencies also might change. So this is all for today. Thank you for your attention. Please subscribe for my new videos that I post almost every day. Thumbs up if you like this video. Goodbye.